there's no substitute for practicing, you know, and uh, students have to be completely honest with themselves about what they don't know and that they have to get on on track and start learning it. So if, a, if you know, the student has to sit down and ask themselves, do I actually know the name of every note on my guitar? And if the answer is no, then now they've just been told what to do. So item number one, <laughs> learn every note on the guitar. You don't have to learn it by today, but do something where every day you get better and better at, at learning every note on every string. The next thing, you say, do I know all the chords? If you don't, well then what are you going to do about it? Do you know all the scales? The answer is no, well then what are you going to do about it? <laughs> and so it's really quite obvious. We just have to be very straightforward with ourselves and, and that's how we arrange our practicing. Uh, but I would say that I remind students all the time that they will not have a career based on the demonstration of practice techniques which means no one will buy a ticket to see Joe Satriani practice guitar. <laughs> they want to see me play the guitar. They want to hear music. So the ultimate goal is playing music, being evocative, lifting people's spirits, being an entertainer. It's all part of it. The practicing is supposed to help you do that. So don't get too hung up on doing that scale faster and faster and faster. Don't spend six hours playing scales uh, you know, with a metronome. I think that's completely useless. You know, if you want to put more than an hour in, I would say, how about 45 minutes doing that stuff? The rest of the time, if you're lucky enough to spend uh, practicing, how about writing music? How about working with sound? How about playing with your friends who are also maybe in, in, uh, at the same stage as you? Uh, seek out some other teachers. Figure out a way to play with people who are better than you are. Figure out how to entertain your little sister's kindergarten class. Uh, you, you know, uh, see if you can get a gig at the local school, um, see if you can get a, a gig at a club, you know what I mean? Just find out what it's like to play for human beings. Because <laughs> right. that's what, you know, I don't want to reduce it to a job, but I mean, that's what a musician does. Society wants musicians to, to make music for them. So, I mean, that's what we're supposed to be doing. So if you're practicing and it's not helping you do that, well, then you're not practicing right.